Okay, everybody, howdy. This is Andre Salazar. Welcome to the Outgroove. Um, got my cowboy hat. We're going to talk about Cowboy Carter here from Beyonce. This is going to be a warm to cold take, okay? But my reasonings might be valid, maybe. This is not a country album. It's not a country album. I don't give a what you say. This is not. I said it. This is not a country album. It is a good album. It is not as great as Beyonce's uh, uh, Renaissance. So it's going to be three albums. Renaissance, which is dance music, which was freaking phenomenal. I bought the LP. It's freaking phenomenal. Okay. Now I love dance music. It was great. Cowboy Carter. I love country. It's good. It's not great. It's not country. I don't give up what you say. Third album, 80s New Wave. Uh, goth. I have no idea what she's doing for that. I would love for her to do some damn Bauhaus. That would be... Joy, please, Beyonce, do Joy Division and Bauhaus for your third album. You know what? I can do that too. Okay, listen. Uh, let's talk about the themes. It is a country-themed album, but it is pop. It is more dance. It is the things that she does more than country. Yes, she brings freaking Dolly Parton, Willie Nelson. She brings in the classics. She plays Jolene, which is a beautiful song. The original. Her version's fine. I don't hate it. Um, but, you know, she's fine. But um, she brings in Willie. But it's not country. I'm sorry, dudes. It's not. I'm sorry, homies. American Rec It starts with American Rec Room. And uh, good. You know, okay, here we go. This is country. She's from Texas. Does she have the right to do a country album? Yeah. Duh. Okay. Black people can do can do rock and roll color color um what is it color purple whatever the hell was it the name, what's the name of that was it band I don't know don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm shooting at all five so I'm really going great today aren't I um so yeah I don't care about race I don't care about where she's from you could be damn Norwegian and pull out the baddest ass country album that don't matter to me none okay but it's just not country the music is not country the beats is not country uh blackbird the second song is a damn beatles song not country it's a folk song not country um 16 carriages it's okay it's good there's some good ones texas hold'em eh, it's okay um Smoke Hour, yeah, with Willie Nelson. He didn't. There's nothing really there. The, the Jolene is good. So she pulls out some songs that are country. She's got mi mi freaking Miley Cyrus, Post Malone. I mean, she's bringing in all the guys, right, to do this kind of thing. But just overall, when you look at it in total, it isn't a damn country song album. It's good. I don't love it like Renaissance. It doesn't have the, as the kids say, bangers, as Renaissance did. Um, now, I'm not saying she needed to do some damn, you know, uh, Merle Haggard or something, or Buck Owens for me to, like, put it over. But I just felt like it wasn't, it wasn't country. It was good. I've listened to it three times, which is sufficient. I don't need to listen to it again. I won't buy it. I won't buy it. Not like Renaissance. Renaissance freaking got me going, dude. Renaissance got me going. It's okay. It's okay. Um, what do you think? Am I right or am I wrong? Am I am I out to lunch? Let me know what you think. That's my take on Cowboy Carter by Beyonce. <laughs>